A safe and sustainable supply of fresh water allows communities to survive and flourish. But around the Earth, water-related challenges are increasing. To safeguard adequate quantities of fresh water of acceptable quality for human well-being and socio-economic development, many countries are promoting sustainable water management, enhancing flood and drought resilience, and improving water purity. Reliable hydrological data and good management of water resources are needed to make informed decisions that stakeholders can trust. But in a majority of developing countries, hydrological monitoring systems are in a poor or declining state. The WMO Global Hydrometry Support Facility, or WMO Hydro Hub, is addressing these challenges by enhancing the collection and sharing of hydrological data around the world. It was in the process of developing the Hydro Hub plan that we really came to the conclusion this is something that we think would make a big difference. So I think right from the beginning, we had confidence that this was going to be a game changer. Established in 2017, with funding from the Swiss Agency for Development and Cooperation, the Hydro Hub is bringing together a broad range of stakeholders from different sectors and providing them with the technical guidance and support they need to build sustainable hydrometeorological operations. The first phase of the Hydro Hub project has delivered on its promise. In Latin America, the Hydro Hub supported countries in delivering improved hydrological information by assessing the needs and capabilities of national hydrometeorological services and other relevant organizations. At this partnership will allow to formulate a roadmap for improved hydrometeorological services in Panama and Costa Rica. And at the end, what we want is a service that is not only technically advanced and efficient, but also sustainable. The Hydro Hub's approach to innovation blends support for cutting-edge technical developments with activities that help monitoring organisations create environments and embrace new solutions and processes. To promote the use of innovative technologies to drive cost-effective and sustainable operations, the Hydro Hub launched two innovation calls, inviting submissions for solutions that can be scaled up around the world. The first innovation call, launched in June 2018, help to explore the operationalization of a low-cost data logger and water level sensor in Bhutan. This project was an initial step towards developing and distributing low-cost water monitoring systems that are free of copyrights and locally manufactured. The second innovation call, launched in July 2020, supported three projects advancing innovation in hydrometry in Belize, Tanzania and the Himalayan region. The Belize project focused on using artificial intelligence to improve the quality of rainfall and water level measurements. Well, the Hydro Hub project was designed to assist us in our quality control procedures to make those procedures more automated. And currently it's been focused on having automated quality control on rainfall and water level data. The Tanzania project looked at using cameras to conduct river flow observations simply and inexpensively. Without data, you can't do anything. You can't even make a decision. So through having those data, we can be in a proper position to manage our water resource management. This project is supplementing our, our internal capacities in correcting water resources data. This is very important for us. The project in the Himalayan region advanced the use of LiDAR technology in mountainous areas. Among the variables uh, available actually non-contact water level observation technologies, LiDAR-based systems are promising because of their capability to reliably measure uh, water levels in highly turbid river systems under various angles while being cost-effective and cost-efficient. Uh, to encourage free and unrestricted data exchange, the Hydro Hub facilitated the implementation of the WMO Hydrological Observing System, or WHOS, in South America's La Plata River Basin and in the Arctic region. WHOS is a hydrological information technology solution that links hydrological data providers and users by enabling real-time data registration, discovery and access and facilitating the sharing of hydrological data across borders. Thanks to the combination of the WHOS components and its functionalities, 
catalog data is available to users through a web-based browser linked directly to the metadata on the data. This has the advantage of being available to all users with internet access. As the project shifts into its second phase, the WMO Hydro Hub will continue to stimulate innovation and improvement of hydrological monitoring systems, supporting sustainable water solutions and securing a better future for all.